from Divine Henna. In this video we're going to do the petals of the Arab fusion flower that we did drew out in pen on the first video. So we start, we already have our circle with little loops, we're going to do the petals. So remember it's the upside down heart shape. So you can either draw the petals in very thinly and then fill them out and go over the top of them to create a more interesting shape. So you want thicker lines, you don't want your lines to be too thin. Or you can apply pressure at the tip of the petal to produce a thick line and then at the base of the petal ease the pressure to produce a thin line. So varying your pressure takes quite a bit of concentration. So it is actually easier just to draw the petal first and then fill out as you go. Sometimes you might not leave enough room for your last petal. In this case we have. But if you didn't, you can just draw a little loop in and that will serve as the next part of your petal. To do the little spokes in the petal, if your th henna is very thin, you can drag from the center. Remember to move very slowly and to do each line, not to get messy and make a big puddle. You want to do each line individually and slowly. This is the real art of henna. It's moving slowly and using concentration. If your henna is thick, you want to lay each line individually and ease off the pressure at the end. So this is the basics of how to do petals. Remember those three elements of control, moving slowly and concentration.